I have been using sliders before you could actually buy them. I built one from industrial components and attempted to motorize it, but failed because it's not as easy as it seems. Then I stepped up to the motorized Kessler Cena slider, which I still use on a regular basis. Recently assignments came up which required complex multi-axis motion control with extreme precision and long rides. Therefore I went for the Detogear Omni Slider Servo 2 meters with Omni Head and Lens Drive, a complete 4-axis package. I admit to be a gear fanatic and a safety maniac because I travel a lot. So it was a no-brainer to get proper custom hot cases to make sure the equipment travels safely. Fortunately, Ditto Gear has these always in stock and they match perfectly because they are custom built for the products. During the past months, I have used Ditto Gear equipment on high mountain tops at well below freezing temperatures, as well as in sunny Greece, carrying the cases on cliffs and at the monastery. not to mention studio and indoor environments and it has proven to be reliable under all these conditions. The cabling system though was not my favorite because sometimes the connector would not screw in right under hectic conditions. But that problem got solved as Ditto Gear moved to the common RG45 standard which makes connecting a breeze and you can find replacement cables of any length in any computer shop. I use different cameras with the Ditto Gear motion control system, from a basic GoPro to my regular Canon 5D Mark III or even the C100. Recently I upgraded the low-level motor controller on the OmniHead, which makes it even more powerful, so I don't have to worry about payload, even with my beloved Zakuto accessories, as long as the head is properly balanced. Since its announcement, I was attracted by the Ditto Gear Modulo concept and unfortunately I did not have enough time to finish my motorized skater dolly and I can't wait to automate the boom of my crane. There are two options for driving the system. I like the wired Omni controllers very much. They can be programmed individually for each axis and then synced via the sync spider and I use them for real time as well as for program moves. Of course they feature functions like drive shoot drive for time lapse and for real time operation you can record your movement and then set your slow motion factor to get ultra smooth and precise movement barely noticeable. Keyframe based wireless control systems seem to be the future and Ditto Gear call it evolution. You program the curves on a tablet and the evolution box does the magic. Of course the path gets downloaded before the ride so you don't get breakups which are inherent to any Wi-Fi connection. And I have only scratched the surface of evolution as my recent projects were more run and gun than quiet studio work. I like Ditto Gear products for their precision, complexity, ease of use and last but not least for their sleekness and elegance. The company offers quick and personal product support and you should take advantage of the great summer offer in place right now, 15% off select products until August the 5th. I'm Edward Schneider, independent filmmaker from Romania.